Before this course, I had no knowledge or basically interest in the whole VR space. Um, got introduced to the course by my dad, he's an alumni of UWC. So he told me about it and I was reading up on VR in that space and then I became interested and yeah, I figured why not try it out, see what it's about and take it from there. Um, I now have coding skills, I have modeling skills, I can build applications and like I said I had no knowledge of this so being able to learn that within, I mean it's about six months that you get before you get your projects. So the course itself really does teach you. I just wanted to change from the sciences and I wanted to enter the 4IR space. So yeah, when I saw the um, email, it was was like fate. <laughs> it was like, yeah, this is exactly what I'm looking for, and it's only a year. So the project that I did was with the geology department. So they have uh, currently what they do is they take their first years out into the field into three spaces: Sea Point, Kloofnik Quarry, and Table Mountain Road. So they're having monetary issues where, you know, finances, they can't always take all the students because the groups or the numbers are increasing. So what we had to do was we had to create a application that teaches the same level of, of skills or knowledge that you get if you were in an actual space. So we created a virtual world where once you're in there, you choose one of your three points. You get to go to Klofnik, you get to go to your sea point or um, Table Mountain Road. You see it from a 360 world, so it's visually as if you're in the space. Then in there, there are hot spots. So what they do is they study like certain points within the areas. If they want to study, for instance, um, spotted rocks, then they click on that point of interest. It's a UI that gives you the information about it. There's a video tutorial on the actual um, rock that you chose. There's your graphs that explain the breakdown. And then we have 3D models that break open so you can see the mineral compositions of the actual rocks. It's a great experience, a great learning curve. You're going to have something that is a qualification that is sought after. It's very rare, especially in Africa. Um, I don't see why not. It, and it, you, you will really grow as a person. Like it, it's an amazing experience. VR is definitely the space that the world is going into. I mean, Forbes did an article about VR itself where they're saying it's going into the billions by 2025. Um, billions in the dollars that's going to make in revenue. So if you're looking financially, definitely the space to go into. Also, educationally, it teaches you in the sense of you're in a visual and an auditory space. So you're completely immersed in a world that teaches you new skills, new techniques, and it's as if you're currently within that space without having to leave the comfort of your home. So definitely, if you want to help grow the world, teach, you know, assist people, you're going to learn these skills. And just if you're interested in, you know, being in an immersive space yourself to learn for yourself, definitely something that you can then build your own apps and work on it, depending on what your interest is.